Hey, uh, this is just a short little video to help some of my artist friends out there um, with cleaning up a paint palette. And uh, as you can see, this is actually part of a door that went, was part, part of a cabinet. And I have, um, it's a glass front. And what I've done is I painted the back side of the glass black. Just got a spray can, cheap dollar or two can and sprayed it black. I find it's easier to mix colors when you're um, on black. They seem to uh, stand out more. And so when I get to close to the end, like with this, I just touched up a painting in one spot. I wanted to add a little more color to it. I mix my colors. Usually I have this whole thing covered with paint. But I'll just take and use my painting knife. And as long as you get it, you know, that day, it comes up pretty easy. And I'll just use... Uh, my painting knife to clean it up. If, if I don't get it all the way cleaned up, I use some kind of scraper and this works really well and I can just scrape it off. And then I wipe this down a little bit and wipe it off. And then, and you can find these at your hardware store. And then lastly, I use a wet wipes, baby wipes, um, whatever's cheapest, <laughs> you should go to like, Walmart or something like that to get them. Uh, and then you could just wipe it down the rest of the way. I mean, there's no need to, you know, I don't think, use wood pallets or anything like that. A piece of glass, like on a door like this, or if you bought a piece of glass, uh, tape the edges so you don't cut yourself. Spray paint the back of it. And then, um, you know, use some wet wipe to wipe it down. You can use this on your knife, your painting knife too. I, I use that a lot to clean my knives. And um, so I hope this helps you. Uh, don't make your artist life a struggle. Make it as easy as you can.